Listen, with this dust falling off of the fucking ceiling, it will all either cave in on us and we're gonna fucking die, or we're gonna get pneumococniosis. Yeah, welcome back to the show. Um, today, I I had to think, well, a couple, anyway, <laughs> something to say. Dude, that's some gun you're carrying over here. You think we all have lightsabers, don't we? That you won't murder us and uh, show that you're actually a pretty good Sith by killing everyone in your way and showing that you're stronger by using a fucking gun. Let's get in his way. Let's see what he's gonna do. He's probably gonna push us around. Because, you know, we're nobodies. Oh, look at that path thing. He actually found a way around. Right. So, the plan is to snitch on Yuthura now and get in more trouble. Somehow get more experience because we need to fix HK uh, quickly. And I was thinking about thinking about um, uh, what's the technology again? Ray light. Shit, man! What was it? Ray tracing. Ray tracing. And I and people are throwing that into older games to you know boost the graphics and make it look even nicer. Uh, on top of of course making everything wet and reflective because that's the uh, stamp of quality reflections. Um, but yeah, I was I was thinking about doing that to this game, and I downloaded um, a special render for the reshade that I'm using for the game for our playthrough. But since I'm a massive procrastinator, I didn't do it before I started recording. So we're going uh, the regular way. Maybe it will be available once, uh, well, in the next episode. Anyway, let's see what the day has for us today. A uh, youth are, listen, how about treason? Greetings, young one. I have found you to be most impressive. You are off to an excellent beginning. Well, let's finish it right here, right now. I'm the best. Just give me the the. Uh, bring me to the tomb is what we what we need to be doing. How do I gain prestige? I have to. I have something to tell you about Yuthura. Oh, what is my apprentice up to now? Treason, betrayal. You know, you should expect that. I would expect you to expect that. You're the head honcho here. You're the Sith as well. Both of you are. She wants more to. She wants me to help her kill you at the final trial. I see. It is good that you have come to me with this information, young one. It yes. is a bit ironic that Euthura has begun her plotting. I have been aware of her growing ambitions for some time, and had in fact already decided to remove her. Normally, the one who gains the most prestige would engage in a final trial. Two of the students would fight. This time, it will be Euthura who battles. Though she does not yet know it. Perhaps it will be you who combats her. Yes, perhaps so. This is what you can do. Give this pad to Adrenus. He will put some poison in her bath. This will weaken Euthura for that final test, making her an easy target. Rather generous of me, don't you think? Mm, this should be interesting. For coming to me with this information and betraying your foolish trainer, I feel you are worthy of prestige, young one. Go now. You have not yet impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. <laughs> oh, dude. We came to him first, knowing the code by heart. Because, yes, uh, we showed that we understand it by him asking us whether victory is... Uh, um, should be achieved by any means. And when we said no, he agreed and said that we know it indeed. And now we bring him the news of his apprentice trying to fucking murder him with me at her side. And he says, well, then just poison her bath so that she's an easier target. Oh, how fucking awful. How fucking undermining of what he tried to teach us. Is it really, you know, you can think, well, maybe it's all about being a Sith and fucking the rules anyway. Maybe they are hypocrites after all, because they're evil, the evil side of this conflict in, in this universe. Um, so they, they'll be uh, talking uh, one thing at one side of their mouth and the other at the other. I think that's the saying, some sort of that. Or 
uh, someone is a fucking idiot and gave you this option uh, which you supposedly would take and they didn't consider that it would um, stand in conflict with what they what they tr were trying to show now who the fuck is adrenal and why would we take it up we don't really need to right we're strong enough anyway and supposedly the master would be at our side anyway so we gonna be the better man and not poison euthura not only because we need not to but also because we need how to be a sith and this Looks like there would be a reason for us to kill um, Uthor after all. He seems to be an idiot uh, or a hypocrite. One of the things that I can stand the least. Incompetence and hypocrisy. So, I'll be on my way then. Very well. you have I'm worthy of prestige of course as well. And then also, uh, no. 600 XP? How much more do I need? Oh! Looks like I'm at the max dark side as, uh, as well. Um, and if you would not notice, uh, all the way up until this point, we seemingly stood in this fiery inferno that you can see uh, behind us here at the upper part of the screen. But as soon, well, as soon, once you reach the very dark side, there's this black mist making you even eviler. Like. <laughs> There is no smoke without fire or something like that, right? But the fire comes only now and only now it's very dark. Anyway, we reached this and there is no like a pop-up prompt to tell us how evil we are. I think once we reach this stage, it pretty much says that the dark side powers are even cheaper, which we would benefit from. So anyway, all oh, right, experience. Yeah. We need like f less than 5000 experience to get a level and try to fix HK again with one more point in repairs. Uh, we can also just leave and try to get some experience on, uh, on other planets really, trying to push the main quest. I think that's how this works. I could. I'll try. We'll see. We'll see. Right, so which way is out? To Dresh Day. That's where we came... oh, this way. That's where we came from. Came from the port. That's what it is. And it just opens to a loading screen. So there is also to the right and to the north. One of those need to lead outside and that's where we need to go. Also, possibly we could look for... Uh, yep, there's some force powers being used. Um, for the outside, whatever. Already forgot what I was talking about. Dueling room. Some prestige can be earned by dueling or murdering the slaves and I guess that's a difficult part I get well we need to get prestige but I don't know how much prestige we do we really need oh look he got so beat up and that he has to cling to his side well we're supposed to be having conflicts with our with our enemies right the people we met already so maybe we should tackle that one way or another. These are unnamed nobodies, so we're not gonna interact with this. Oh, we are having a combat music right now. I don't know if you can hear that. Yeah, combat music. And we're not having any combat. <laughs> Someone else is having a combat. Um, yeah, we're gonna open up a box and then just leave. Then just leave, because these are nobodies. If we'll miss... Uh, any prestige, we will be missing out on whatever. We will be short. If we will be short on prestige, we will come back here and try to do essentially side quests, right? But um, right. interrogation room. Oh, this interrogation room. Yeah, doesn't matter either. Maybe you can do better than I. I don't this ask. Mandalorian is proving more resistant than I expected. Uh. No thanks. Fine, go then. I must know where his weapon cache is. Damn him. I'm pretty sure we can just interact with him. Let's 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 make sure maybe. Quick save. Don't bother me. I'm trying to think how I'm going to question this prison. Right, so I guess uh we can apply for this quest again. Fine. Yes, yes. Now 
buckets. Oh, it looks like the combat music is not going away. Kind of bummer. Probably if we reload the area by, you know, moving back and forth. But we're trying to... Oh, Druid Heavy Plating Type 3. We know who that uh, is gonna look good on. We already have that, don't we? Type 2. Only Type 2. Look, Defense Bonus plus 10. Defense Bonus plus 11. It is only plus one more. But it is one, pl one, one more. Plus one more, right? Yeah, okay. The crossbow. Still doesn't have... Uh, the things feeds for dual wielding. Right. Yeah, this room. If I'll ever, I'll mention. Don't worry. But I'm not gonna mention now because logistics. Anyway. Oh, there we go. The music is gone. That's good. <clears throat> so outside we go, I guess. Or we could um, aggravate our direct competition. Oh well. Looks like the music is back. Or we could aggravate our direct competition right now. But I think that's necessary. I think we're gonna need to deal with them either way. As soon as we step our foot outside. Come on now. Keep walking. Um, and the quests start happening. Yeah, keep practicing. Keep practicing with live lightsabers. What have you got in here? Just a bunch of shit. Good enough. Looting is still is still fine. Sith teacher, Sith student. Don't let me interrupt you. Find a room, you guys. Fucking, you're in the middle of you know school. Fucking <laughs> uh, organizations, man. They've got dormitories with their shitty rooms, but they don't have a room, a class for a class. Oh, there's a drenas for uh, the poison. Good luck. I missed the box. Should I be <laughs> trying to open it with Blaster Fire with uh, HK? Would he be Ready. better at it? Yep. Well, he hit. Well, he missed. I guess not. Yep. I guess not. Keep at it then with the lightsaber. Really? All you need to do is cut along the fucking lock. You don't need to try to bash it. You don't need to try to hit it. Amazing. Right, and a little tidbit as well is um, Tariga. So, Sith teacher, I thought he would be the teacher, but Tariga is a guy who doesn't speak common actually. He understands it, but he uses Hatiz, I'm pretty sure, because he either was a slave or grew up on Hata. Not sure. Don't care. That's the story though, you can ask him about it and he'll speak. To you about it in Hatiz, right? The door. And now the Valley of the Dark Lords. Oh, there it is. At last, my search is over. I was beginning to fear someone else had killed you and deprived me of the pleasure. You may have defeated the pathetic bounty hunter my master sent after you, but you are no match for me. I have studied at the foot of the Dark Lord himself. Right, sure, whatever you say. Who are you again? Did we meet? We, we did, didn't we? Or was it someone else? Down in Taris. Must have been someone else, because we killed him. Um, yeah, so obviously this is Darth Bandon. We may, well, the game mentioned him already. He's here to kill us. We're not gonna let him. Poor guy, he's gonna die. And also two blokes. Are they twins? Probably, probably. Now, if you're Malak's apprentice, can't say I'm impressed. You were on the Underspire, you killed Trask. Oh, that's the guy. You killed Trask, he'll pay for that. Uh, we hardly knew him. Uh, when will Malak learn? I'll kill you, just like I killed Kalanord. You're a fool if you think you can defeat me. Um, three of those are good enough, interesting enough for me, to me. I like three of them. I don't like one. <laughs> Um, what would be, what would be good? What do you think? Ah, uh, let's go with three, cause, cause why not? When will Malak learn? I'll kill you just like I killed Kalanor. Your words mean nothing to me, unless you wish to beg for your life. No? Then I shall try to make this both quick and painful. Well, we weren't given a choice. 
Doesn't matter. Um, insanity. Oh, this guy goes through. Mm. Again we go. Oh, saved again. Well, then kill it is. If he's so strong willed, then he's gonna be weak. Uh, what is it? Weak fortitude. Now, we could use slow, because why not? Did it work? Can't even tell. Anyway, how about insanity instead? He's a warrior after all, he should be weak willed. Well, resist it again. Let's try that again. Maybe at least on him. Oh, well. Damn it! It's as if they're strong. Well, fortunately, we've got uh, ways to deal with that as well. Oh, right, I think he's got the force power used. The force powers that I said I'm not, never gonna be need to be using. What? That I said that I won't be needing to use. What? Right, like so. Ah, shit, I've been stunned. Now that's bad. Dude, uh, healing. And a lot of it. Yes? There we go, that's good. Now, since we're already here. Everyone's draining everyone, looks like. Now, uh, kill maybe? Alright, so, oh, he saved. Anyway. Uh, I'm forgetting which buttons do what. Damn. Lightning, 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 lightning. Oh, he resisted that as well. Is this going to be a fucking lightsaber duel? It is obvious that this contest cannot be decided by our knowledge of the force. But by our skills. Um, that's not good. Looks like we're gonna need a little bit of a med pack here. Shit, I'm stunned. Which is not good. Well, Jolie is run, has run out of force powers, of course he has. Jolie, you've got better things. Oh, you don't. Well, I take that back. You, however, do have better things to do than regular attacks. Can I just, you know, cheese it? Damn it, it's being hard. Fuck. If only I did the side quests. Where are my med packs? Advanced ones. There we go. Used. It worked. No, don't use that. You can do better. He's resisting still. Damn it. That's bad. Well, let's try flurry. Well, miss, miss, and miss. He did say, but he didn't resist. We're getting through to him. Yeah, now he's now he's he's, he's over. That's over. He's done. Right. So that's good enough, I think. Now, kill. Oh, he saved. Jolie's out. Not too good. He saved. Shit. Now, have a taste of your own med medicine, perhaps? He's saving awfully lot! Well, that's not good. Cheese it with the menus. And try until he doesn't make it. I think he saved again. Insanity, maybe that will work now. Well, we didn't get the chance to do it. See you right when we get there again. Alright, we've been over this. Yes, yes, yes. Now, we must be quick. Will he be faster than him? No, we won't be. However, they are down, so... With that, we can eliminate them faster and focus on the main boss. He didn't resist the kill. Alright. Now. Uh, 
everything you've got, of course. That should be good enough now. Buffs. We could use buffs. Knight's Valor. Yes. Have has everyone got that already? Knight speed. Alright. And then for Zora maybe? One thing or another, right? Oh he saved against right. kill. I don't think he saved against this one this time. No, he might have. One more, come on. There we go, I think he got him. I think. Right. Just to make sure, right? Anyway, so. He's force resistful right now. Ah, shit. HK, you're gonna need a fix. We did put a better armor on you, didn't we? But fix is a fix. We think you can fix yourself a little bit. Repair kit. Out of turn. That's good. Shit attacks. That's bad. Good thing we've got 33 armor as well. And on our part, just hit him with the lightsaber. Um, HK can use another pack. It's not like we're holding off on those. And we're doing pretty well, you know. Once we start hitting him, uh, I guess, across the head with a lightsaber, he becomes a little bit softer. Where are the med packs for robots? There we go. I saw them. There they, uh, there they are. Out of turn again. Yes. Look, dude, you're doing the wrong attack. I really need you to dish out the things. Have we really run out of buffs? Buffs? Do I, do you need to rebuff us again? Maybe. Oh, he's draining us with the circle of death. How annoying. Now, let's see. Is it good enough yet for our post powers? You can't drain Jolie, he's already dead. Hey, this is cheating. You can't drain Jolie, he's already dead. Is he draining me this much? Look. You're getting on my nerve. Do I have to t uh, pull out the big guns? Like with the robes that you've seen? Where are the fucking med packs? Now, out of turn healing. We need to hit him with something stronger. <laughs> Keep doing that until it works. I'm sure it will eventually, right? Yes. Oh, now he. Ah, oh, fuck. This again? Come on now. Hey, hey, come on, HK. No. Oh, we're dead. Hey, can we. We can just use a med pack again. Damn, these fights are getting harder when you're not leveling up, I guess. Good thing a stun is just a mild inconvenience rather than an actual threat. Oh, I can't use it anymore right now. Fuck. Ah, shit. Well. So, as usual, insanity. Hopefully that's, that, 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 <laughs> this will work. Speed. Knight's Valor. And you do just shoot a lot. Yes. It didn't work at all. Both of them saved. What the shit? One got down. Or at least stunned. Now. Since you're so strong, how about killing you? Is he still saving? I don't know. I can't tell. The droid efficiency has at its best already run out. Now he's using a shit attack. Okay. Um, now Dark Jedi. Yes. Right, Dark Jedi should be down now. Now I should flank. Jolie, you should focus on something else. How about... Heals. Do some heals. Oh yeah, again, you. Thank you. You're really fucking... 
I hate this AI, man. I hope the remake will address this. Hopefully. Repair kits. I'm standing behind him and I'm doing any not doing any damage. Oh, he got insanity now. Let's give him a little bit more of a fix again. He'd figured out my only weakness. The fact that I'm using uh, force powers almost exclusively. Ah, save this time. Do it until he doesn't. Uh, Jolie, you're gonna need that. You can be more useful when you're not dead, at least you'll be doing something. As opposed to just giving him health for free. Droid efficiency at its best. Come on, run out of fucking hell! Soon enough we're gonna start just chucking grenades and you're gonna go fuck yourselves. Mm-hmm. I can tell. Look how efficient he is. Yes. Oh, I'm just dead? Okay. That's fine. Shit. This is not a good day. Speed. Just uh, start dumping on him. Knight's Valor. This guy is tr <laughs> causing us trouble. Out of all things. Right, well, you. Whoever fights with the sword dies of a sword or something like that. Robert ran out of options as well. I'm being murdered, someone help me. Oh my god, automatic auto attack. So I think there are a few approaches to a fight like this, one of them being the obvious Pokemon tactics of disregarding the types and just over leveling for the challenge. But I think the other approach they expected you to take was to play a warrior. Are they dead yet? Or at least have one in your party. We decided to let Juhani die, or just outright murder her, so that's not an option for us. Oh, did Darth Bandon get stunned as well? Sick, we've got an advantage. Yes, he's stunned. Dump on him, dump on him. Enough! Oh my god, you fucking idiot, you're wasting your force powers casting the same buff over and over again. This game, dude, this game, more like this gay. Um, attack, attack, motherfucker, attack. What happened now? Fuck off. And now I'm dead. Canonically, Revan was more of a warrior than a wizard, so as such you were also expected to be more of a fighter, with more health and better hit chance. And I'm pretty sure I mentioned that at the beginning as well, saying me picking the wizard class is gonna be problematic once we get to the final boss. Babysitting this idiot dude. He ran out of force powers and I can't buff myself when I need to, cause the buffs run out. Thanks, Jolie, you're so good at this. That's why I kind of appreciate Dragon Age 2, where the main character is canonically a wizard, though you can choose from all the typical archetypes of a warrior, a thief, and a mage. HK, ladies and gentlemen, built to kill Jedi. The other thing that I could have done that I'm only now trying to do here is to go even harder on med packs and even weaker on force powers, trying to influence Darth Bandon with any sort of kill or insanity. That lucky stun that I got in the previous try was just too low of an odds to pursue. I should have gone ahead and tried to hit him upside the head with the lightsaber from the get go. What I couldn't have gone for, however, was trying to use any sort of debuff like slow or sickness, 
especially the plague, since we are not high enough level to get access to the highest tier of that force, which is irresistible essentially, that gives you DC 100 to not be affected. But I'm still not sure whether his force immunity aura would make him immune to that anyway. Yeah, not this again, I'm low on health again. Go fight someone unimportant, dude. Fortunately, I did have enough of the low-level med packs to use them quite freely and wait for Bandon to run out of his mana so that he cannot cast Circle of Death anymore. And having a robot means that he won't be able to heal from him and damage him. So at least there was something I did right. What are you doing, old man? Something that's not gonna help anyone. Looks like. Right, Valas are on. And we're running out of force slowly, but surely. Again. Get unstunned. There we go. Shit. Oh, fuck me, dude. There we go, finally, dude. Uh, all you needed to do is babysit everyone. So, hopefully you enjoyed this prolonged boss fucking battle. Thanks for watching, thanks for sticking by, and hopefully we will see each other in something else I play for you for free. In the meantime, of course, interact with everything on the channel, including this video, by liking, subscribing, commenting, and shit like that. And if you don't like it, if you didn't like this, it's entirely your fault. I mean, fucking, I don't know what level I was, I don't know what level this was, um, and these are half my level anyway, well, they're not half level, they're under level, well, they're below my level. They're below my... Everything is below my level. Let's face it. So, at least, what's the loot here? Also, Darth Bandon, here on Korriban, where we came to the heart of the Sith Empire, he's here waiting for us, and we're admitted to the fucking academy to become a Sith, and he's there, standing there, on orders from Malak to murder us because he and Malak knows who we are. Some communication here, maybe. Maybe then it, you would have had an easier time killing me. You had a pretty fucking easy time killing me, actually. So, Darth Bandon's fiber armor. All he well, he did use light drain. So, is that force restricted by armor? Would that be better than what I'm wearing? Probably not. Probably Jedi robes are max dexterity, defense bonus, and lets you use the thing. Defense bonus plus 5, max dexterity plus 5, damage resistant fire, upgradable armor. Fortunate fate of Darth Bannon, this light armor remains a desirable asset for any warrior. The sl silvery polish reflects a pride of craftsmanship, a rarely seen today. And I won't be able to see if it restricts lights, uh, if it restricts force powers, if I don't have a fight to go in. So I don't know, I'm gonna put it in and... If any problem starts, I'm just gonna swap it out. So, seemingly this is what Darth Bandon wore. No, it's not. I already wore what Darth Bandon wears. Where is it? There it is. This is how we should look like. I mean, how hard was it to model that? Fuck off. There we go then, I guess. Uh, Darth Bandon robes again. Uh, if the regular clothes will not work for us, uh, we'll use Darth Bandon's armor, and if that won't work, we'll use uh, regular Jedi armor, which is to say Jedi robes. Oh, also, by the way, yes. it would be pretty cool if we actually just healed up a little bit, as far as we can. Uh, at least the flesh and bones uh, characters. And yeah, thanks. Thanks for, for joining me. Thanks for slogging through the bass battle. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. 
Hey! Oh, how perfect, right? Don't worry, stick, 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 stick with me just a little bit longer. Everything's fine. Nope, nope, it blocks force. Even though he was using uh, Drain Life, Circle of Death specifically, which is restricted by armor, we can do it. If we were a warrior that wasn't using force, uh, uh, offensive force powers, only buffs maybe, or something else, or not relying on force powers at all, pretty much, other than maybe force jump, uh, that would be useful. But f of course, we are, we are uh, a mage, and no one cares about mages. So there. See ya.